Hey everyone, welcome to Gentle PSD. I hope you're all having a beautiful day. Today in this exciting tutorial we will be learning about how to isolate any color in our video in Premiere Pro. This can be done easily by two different amazing tools in Premiere Pro. I will explain it one by one, to make sure you get a good grasp of it. Before we begin please make sure to hit the subscribe button and bell icon for more amazing tutorials like this. Without any further ado let's begin. Create a new project. I will name it as Isolate. Click OK. We will bring our three stock videos onto our project panel. Now drag one video onto the sequence to create a new sequence. Here we have this lady unveiling a yoga mat. We will isolate this yellow color on this mat. Before we begin, I want you to know that, there are two ways you can isolate and color in Premiere. One is simple and basic, and other is advanced where we have many options to work on it. First I will show you the basic tool. Go to effects and type in, leave color. Now take this color effect and place it on our video layer. In the effects control. Here we have our leave color effect. We will select the yellow color since we want it to isolate from the video. Take this color picker tool and click on the yellow mat to choose that color precisely. As you see nothing has changed, but if I bring this decolor to 100%. There, we now isolated our yellow color perfectly. Let's play it. This looks amazing. You can use the tolerance to adjust how much yellow color you want in the surroundings like reflection. Use the soft edges to loosen some sharp edges around our yellow mat. If your color haven't changed after you increased the decolor, try choosing the hue option in the color match. Now we will apply this on another video. Bring it on the sequence and play it. We will isolate this red color brush. Take the leave color and place it on the video layer. In the effects control choose that red color using the color picker tool. Increase the decolor to 100%. As you see unlike our previous video this selection looks terrible. Just like I said, if it look like this then change the color match to hue. And just like that we fixed that terrible selection. But still some reflection and shadows are present in our video. Adjust the tolerance to minimize the side colors. Let's play it. It looks good. As I said before this tool is only basic and we won't have many options to play with it. When you want to do this effect quickly, you can use this tool, but when you want to get that absolute perfection, then use the second method that I'm going to teach. Now bring in the third video. We will again use the leave color to isolate his pants. Add the leave color effect and select his pant color. Use the tolerance and softness to adjust the surroundings. You can change the color match to hue if you want, both RGB and hue works well. Let's play it. That looks perfect. 
Now I will show you the advanced method for this particular effect. You will have many options to customize it to your need. Select this video and delete the leave color effect by pressing backspace on your keyboard. Go to effects panel and type in lumetric color. Take it and place it on our video. Go to effects control. Here in the Lumetric click on this curve tool option. Go to hue saturation curves. Here we have the hue saturation curve. Now do the same like we did on our leaf color tool. Take the color picker and select the red color. As you see our red color is selected and a new points in the hue saturation line being created. Now here comes the biggest advantage of this tool. That is, Take the color picker again and this time choose the red color on a different side. As you see a new light red point is added to our saturation line. Because of this tool, we can add as many variant of that particular color as we want and it will give us more option to perfect it. Once you done selecting all the variants in that color. Now we can desaturate the other colors. To do that click on this line near the orange point and bring it down like this. As you see our red and slightly orange color is only stayed, and rest of the color are gone. Now again click on this point near the red and bring it down again. Now we will remove that orange tint in that brush shadow. Click on this orange point and bring it down until you can't see any orange tint in the video. There, we now completely removed that orange tone and it looks super perfect. As I said, by using this tool we can get that accurate color separation. Let's play it. That looks awesome. We will now add Lumetri on our first video. Select the first video and delete the leave color. Place Lumetri color on our first video layer. Go to Hue Saturation Curves. We will isolate this matte blue color along with this lady's blue cloth. Take the color picker and select the matte color. Now select the ladies cloth color. Now click on the line near the blur point and bring it down. Do the same here. As you see we now separated our blue color almost. There are some violet color left behind. We will remove it by bringing down this end. And just like that we completely and perfectly separated our blue color in this video. You can use this hue points to bring down some of the blue leaks in our video. Don't overdo it, just bring the color only when it's necessary, otherwise it will remove some of the color from our video. Now let's play it. That looks perfect. As you see our blue shadows and highlights are perfectly separated. We now know how to isolate any color in our video with these two different tools. I hope you learned something from this tutorial. Thank you for supporting my work, your support is what gives me the strength to make more amazing tutorials like this. Please keep supporting me and I will work even more harder. Thank you.
We are finally at the end of our tutorial. I hope you enjoyed this video. You can always download all my project files on Patreon. Link is in the description. I will keep posting more amazing tutorials like this. Please look forward to it. If you have any doubt feel free to comment in the comment section. I will reply to it as soon as I can. Hit the subscribe button for more amazing tutorials like this. Hit the like button if you like this video. Until our next tutorial stay happy. Thank you.